Hi, this is Renee Olivia, and in this video, we're going to talk about complementary colors and how to use your wardrobe to create the looks. But first, for all things beauty and fashion, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the bell. That way you never miss a video I put out every week. I'm also going to put up my Instagram and my TikTok, so go ahead and take a look at those as well. Okay, so let's get started. Um, I'm going to talk about complementary colors. I'm going to put the graph up right here for you to take a look at, and then you can go into your closet and find clothes to kind of mix and match. And it just creates different looks that you may not have thought of before or that you're like, really, those two go together? But these are complementary colors. It has been, you know, researched. I did my research and I didn't buy any new clothes. I literally went into my closet and started picking out, okay, this is an orange, this is a blue, green, red, and then tried to create looks that actually look nice. There are some that do not look nice, and I'm gonna kind of show you like what I feel personally is a nice complement to each other, and then ones that are a little bit too much for me. Again, this is very um, subjective, uh, so you kind of have to go with what you're comfortable with. So this is the first thing, um, orange and blue. I picked a very peachy color orange and then a baby blue for the pants. And I feel like it's a very subtle complimentary um, outfit and I really, really like it. And I never put these two together before. And I, and I really, really like it, like I said, and um, I think they work well together. Now I'm gonna show you an orange and a blue that not so good. Okay, so here is, so let me also explain uh, what a complementary color is because some people don't know. I had to actually research. A complementary color is, and like you can see on the graph, they're colors that are completely opposite of each other on the color wheel. Um, so you take a look at the color wheel and it'll just, if they go exactly opposite, then they're complementary colors. So this is orange and blue. Um, I'm not a fan of it. Um, some people might. I feel like this is very bold. If they're bold colors together. Um, I just personally am more of a muted. That's why I chose the more peachy and light blue. But this is, some people would love this and it's actually not terrible. But again, these two are completely opposite each other on the color wheel. And um, let me know what you think, which one you like better, the more muted tones or the more, more bold tones. So I'm gonna put together a few more looks. Again, I found these all in my closet and you tell me which ones you like and which ones you don't. Okay, so this is the next color combination, the, the red and the green, as you can see. So I, again, went with more, new, not neutral, but muted tones, not like super bold. And these pants are great. I got these from Zara, and then I just paired it with this Amazon tank that is like a deeper like maroon red but i think it's great i love it i would never have thought to put them together some people might think oh you look a little bit too christmasy like a christmas ornament but it's a great option if you have a holiday party coming up in six months or so <laughs> but um but i like it i feel like it's it's different um and i like that and i, I like being able to use your wardrobe in different ways and being creative so let me know what you think and then I'll try a little bit more bolder colors to see which one you like better. Okay, so these are the more bold uh, green and red that I had in my closet. Again, I would never put these two together. Some people like this um, palette and color palette. I'm just, it's, I'm not sold on this right here. Um, let me know what you think. Um, but these are <laughs> what I had in my closet and yeah. Uh, way too Christmassy for me. Okay, so for this combination, I did uh, yellow and purple, and I found in my closet uh, the mustard yellow and a deep, deep purple. I really like this combination together. I feel like it's a very complimentary, um, something that I would absolutely go out in public with and be perfectly um, comfortable. Uh, I'm gonna see if I can find um, more bold um, yellows and purples to see if you can see the difference. But again, go through your closet, find things that you feel comfortable with, and you can create a whole new wardrobe with different looks that you never thought would go together. So that's why I like the complementary color scheme. I think it's super fun and it creates different looks that you never would have thought of. Okay, so I had to really dig into my closet to find another purple-yellow combination. 
So I found this um, little cute tea, yellow tea, and this is actually a purple dress that I wear to work. And I just put this over top and you put some flip flops on and you have like a cute brunch, you know, errand running kind of outfit and for the summer. So I really like it. And again, I would have never thought to put these two together. I'm curious to what your thinking is. Do you like the color combinations? Do you always do it? Is this something new to you? But again, I feel like it can create a whole new sort of wardrobe outfit, outfits that you never would have thought of previously. And it just kind of expands your wardrobe. So let me know your thoughts on that. Okay, so that was my video on complimentary colors. I hope you liked it. I hope you found it helpful. If you did, please comment down below, like the video. And again, if you're not subscribed, I would really, really, really appreciate it. And I will see you all next week.